All right, here, so we're starting with percent composition. We know this molecule has 60.8% sodium, 28.60% boron, and 10.6% hydrogen. And we need to find the empirical formula. And remember, the empirical formula is that simplest form. Okay, so the first thing we do when you're given percentages, then just assume 100 grams and rewrite as grams. So this would be 60.80 grams of sodium, 28.60 grams of boron, 10.60 grams of hydrogen. So we just took the percentage off and changed it for grams. Now, if you were doing this and they started you off with grams, then you don't have to find the percent composition. You just have to go right from these numbers. Next step, convert from grams to moles. Same way we've been doing that, molar mass. Okay, sodium, grams is on the top, grams goes on the bottom. 22.99 grams in one mole. Boron has, looking on the periodic table, 10.81 grams in one mole. And hydrogen has 1.01 .01 grams in one mole. If you needed to write that over one, just so that you can remember that it is going to be going um, grams in the numerator to grams in the denominator, that's fine. Just make sure, just like always, that you're able to cancel. And then you're only converting to moles. So that is the only conversion that you're doing. 60.80 divided by 22.99. 2.64 moles, 28.60 divided by 10.81, 2.65 moles, 10.60 divided by 1.01, 10.50 moles. And what we're doing here is now we are going to divide by the least. And what you do to one you're gonna to do to all of them. So least is 2.64. So we're gonna divide by 2.64 for every single one. Okay, and now we're gonna to round to the whole number if you're in general chemistry, around to the nearest half if you are in H chem, and round to the quarter if you're in IB. So 2.64 divided by 2.64, that's 1. So everybody would have 1. 2.65 divided by 2.64 is 1.00. So again, everybody would be rounding to 1 because that is the closest quarter. And 10.50 divided by 2.64 that's 3.98, and so everybody, again, would be rounding to 4 moles. If it was something where this answer in moles was 4.5, if you were in H chem, you would leave it 4.5. If it was something like 4.22, you would round to 4.25 if you were in IB. So you round to the nearest whole number if you're in general chemistry, the nearest half if you were in honors chemistry, and the nearest quarter if you're in IB. And now we have our answer. So there is one sodium, and actually we don't even have to call it moles, one boron and one hydrogen, and four hydrogens. So how do we rewrite that? Na1, B1, H4. And if you're in general chemistry, just rewrite it in the same order that they gave you your percent compositions for. If you are in honors chem, rewrite it the same order that you found it in. In IB, write it in the order that you would find if you were converting this into a molecular formula. Okay. But NABH4.